G'day guys, welcome back to another episode of Flashlight Crazy. Today I am reviewing the comparison between the Olight Javelot Pro 2 on the left and the Olight Javelot Turbo on the right. Let's check it out guys. Alright, so... First difference about these two that immediately catches my eye is the body. So if you see here, the texture on the bodies are very, very different. Uh, this one here has kind of like your typical warrior texture. And this one is something I haven't seen before on Olight. Uh, it's a lot smoother. Um, but then again, is it more slippery? It may be. I don't know. I haven't used these in the wet, so I can't comment. But just by feel... Um, this, the, the Pro 2 definitely feels like it has more grip, uh, than the Turbo, but I could be wrong because as I said, I haven't used them in the wet. Now, the second major difference I can see here is the side switches. So my preference is definitely the side switch on the Pro 2 because as you can see, you've got your battery level indicator there. Each LED represents 25% and you've also got your output level here which I love. So that's low, that's medium, that's high, that's turbo. So I really love that about the uh, Pro 2, whereas the Javelot Turbo just simply has a one LED there, which, you know, is like oh, above 60%. And then orange is, you know, 30 to 60% and red and flashing red and this and that. And it's just like, mate, give me, give me this, you know, it's so much more clear. Um, but the Turbo has a lot of things over the Pro 2 as well, which I will cover uh, very, very shortly. Another difference, guys, is the LEDs. But apart from that, look at that. They, uh, they're they pretty identical with their beautiful smooth reflectors and uh, very deep, deep LEDs down there. Now, the measurements are from head to tail. The Turbo comes in at 25 and a half centimeters and the Pro 2 comes in at 25 and a half centimeters. So identical in size, in height. Now the Pro 2 face width is 6.3 centimeters and the Turbo is 6.3 centimeters. So again, very, very similar, if not identical as well. Now, weighing them. I'm going to have to take them apart, but I can assure you that the turbo is lighter than the pro. So that's just going off my feel, but let's do it like this. So the head of the turbo comes in at 186.84 grams and the head of the pro two comes in at 197.91. 186, 197, okay, already. Now, the body of the turbo, 225.8, and the Pro, 225.08. Okay, so about 0.8 of a gram difference, uh, or 0.7.5 gram difference. So the difference in weight is all in the head, guys. Just as a reminder, let me just tear that. So just reminding, 186.86, 197.94 now. So big difference between between these. It's about 11 grams difference between the, the weight. So that is where you are getting uh, this feeling of the turbo being so much lighter than the Pro 2 um, because, in fact, it is. Now, both these lights can be mounted on weapons there. They can be mounted with pressure switches there. That's the uh, area there that can be mounted on a pressure switch that doesn't come off, this little lip here. Um, so they are both uh, pure, pure hunting, hunting lights. The UI on them is identical. So starting with the tail caps, if I do a quick half press, you get to your low mode. Now, low mode on the Pro 2, is 15 lumens, which will last for 12 days, and low mode on the turbo is 15 lumens, which will last for 13 and a half days. Now, a full press on the tail cap is gonna get to turbo, and turbo on the Pro 2 is 2,500 lumens for five minutes, and turbo on the turbo 
is 1300 lumens that you get for 10 minutes. But there is a massive difference in throw, guys. So the Pro 2 is gonna reach 1,050 meters because it's pushed out by 271,000 candela, whereas the Turbo is gonna reach 1,300 meters because it is pushed out by 422,500 candela. And as you can see there, there is a difference in color temperature as well, bit more of a neutral white in the uh, Turbo. There's that, and there's that. Fuck, they are just awesome though. They're, they're honestly, Freaking sick lights, these two. Honestly, if you are a hunter or a light enthusiast or anything like that, bloody pick yourself up one, man, because you will not regret it. They are friggin' sweet. Now, side switch UI, very, very similar, if not identical. Press and hold to turn on, and there we have it. Now, single press to cycle up. That's it. And it will cycle from low, medium, high, turbo. That's it. Now, full press to turn it off, full press to turn it on. When you do turn it on, guess what? Comes on in your last output that you had with the side switch. Brilliant. Now, when they are off, single press gives you battery level indicator. Single press, battery level indicator. Much prefer the Turbo, uh, the uh, Pro 2's battery level indicator than the Turbo. Now, neither of these lights have lockout, so just uh, dis disable their their connection by taking the battery pack off uh, when you when you are traveling if you want to. All right, now. Just another quick beam profile shot before we head outside. Bigger hotspot in the Pro 2, but less uh, less throw. Tighter hotspot in the Turbo, more throw, more neutral color, more candela, more lumens, more candela. All right, let's head outside and uh, be back for some final thoughts with these two beasts. There is the Pro 2, and there is the Turbo. Much, much tighter beam on the Turbo much more light out of the Pro 2. Pro 2, turbo. Just move away from that hill. Just move away from that hill there. All right, there's the turbo there. Javelot turbo, Javelot Pro 2. Turbo, Pro 2. Turbo, Pro 2. Now you get five minutes on uh, high on turbo with the Pro 2 and you get 10 minutes with that tight hotspot on the turbo. Turbo, I mean Pro 2, sorry. Javelot Pro 2, Javelot Turbo. They are freaking incredible. Amazing. That's the Pro 2 again, guys. More light, that's the turbo, more candela. Amazing. All right, back to the lab, guys. Woo! All right, what do we think? What do we like? What do we What do we want? Um, personally, I am going to go the Pro 2. I'm sorry, uh, you know, I'm not a hunter, so I don't need that extra throw and the tighter hotspot. I don't need the extra five minutes of runtime on turbo, because remember, guys, 10 minutes on turbo here, whereas five minutes here. Remember that, big difference. Uh, so for me, being just a light enthusiast, not a proper hunter, I definitely like the Pro 2 better because of the higher lumens and cooler white color. Um, but also, this side switch, I can't go past. Sorry, but I like it better than this one. I don't know why they didn't keep it. All O-lights with a side switch should have this side switch because it's just bloody brilliant. Um, so a quick uh, recap on differences. So the Turbo is a lighter torch than the Pro 2. The Turbo will reach 1,300 meters. The Pro 2 will reach 1,050 meters. The Turbo has 422,000 candela. The Pro 2 has 271,000 candela. The Turbo has 1,300 lumens. The Pro 2 has 2,500 lumens. So Pro 2 has it over the Turbo there. Uh, so guys, which one do you want? Uh, or do you want both? That is the question. Now, if you do want one or both of these, you can head over to lightshop.com.au. Uh, there is a bit of a difference in price. I believe the uh, Pro 2 comes in at 280, 290 bucks, something like that. And the Turbo comes in at 317, $318. So a bit of a difference there. But if you click on the links that I give you and then uh, type in your 
your discount codes because it's over $200, you will get 10% off these lights, guys. All right. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, it's been an absolute pleasure reviewing these two machines of lights. Very, very happy. Please join me again on another episode of Flashlight Crazy Guys. And until next time, stay cool and stay safe. See ya.